School shortly after 10 a.m. after the district sent an email about a report that someone may have brought a gun to school. Darlin Horn was there. She's here for you now with what we know so far. Darlin. Jormer, I spoke to some of the parents this morning who tell me they are outraged, but not surprised that the school went on lockdown, especially after last night's board meeting where parents and staff spoke up about their concerns with ongoing violence at the school. Some of the parents who attended that board meeting last night say they cried for most of it as students and faculty spoke to the board about how afraid they are every day they walk through the doors. One student even expressed how she doesn't even use the bathroom when she's at school and waits until she goes home. Faculty voiced their concerns as well as some of them say they recently tried to break up a brawl and a gun fell out of a student's pocket. One parent who was outside this morning and attended last night's board meeting says something needs to change. There are fights every day, and I'm not talking about just hair pulling. It's brutal. My daughter came home covered in other people's blood last year. It's not a good environment. And the school board has strong-armed our administration by not, by not following through, doing better for all of these kids here. They're not doing anything for them. So this is an ongoing, everyday situation here in East Lansing Public Schools. Now, last we checked, the school is still on lockdown. East Lansing police were on the scene, but would not confirm anything else about the investigation. Once again, there was a report of a gun was brought to school, but so far, no confirmation from police or the district. We'll continue to follow this story and have the latest tonight on 6 News. Jorma, back to you.